Today we're at 709 Miami Court, McDonough, Georgia, doing a quality control inspection. Beautiful home. It's just been renovated. Yard's been cleaned up, recently raked. New pine straw put around. Looking at the gutters right now, they do have gutter guards installed. This one needs to be flipped over. It looks like it's leaning outward to the left. But it's especially needed in the backyard. These hardwoods will fill those up, those gutters up in no time if you don't have them. That's our AC unit doing a good job inside. Same thing with our gas meter over there. One of the selling features of this home is a privacy fence. And unfortunately, something I'm beginning to notice is probably nine out of 10 privacy fence entries, the gates are messed up. I wonder if we can start including that in our scope of work. You can obviously see there needs to be some adjustment here. There is no latch, no way of securing, and it rides super low. You really can't even move the door. Along the back, we have a uh, chain link fence. Let's take a look at the home. Again, the home is in great shape. We do have something to uh, splash that water away there underneath that rain gutter, which is good. Lastly, the right side of the home has a walk under crawl space that I'm unable to access. Due to there being a padlock, like master lock, the key that was left on the counter does not fit it so I will not be able to take a look at that interior AC unit I recommend that that lock be removed so that the tenants can change the air filters regularly hopefully there is a spare left in there for our checklist have a concern on the back deck you can see how there's some uh, boards that were replaced This railing uh, has an exposed one, two, three nails. It looks like 10 penny nails. I recommend we use some deck screws to secure that railing. Let's take a look inside. Inside we have a beautiful fireplace, masonry, stone, gas assist. Really looks good inside. Got some cord around it sticking out a little bit. Just a couple of nails will fix that. First area of wood that comes out here, I don't know if you can see it. It's almost a quarter of an inch down when you step here. The subfloor is off where that piece needs to be secured. It's obviously a tripping hazard. And all bedrooms are missing smoke detectors within three feet of the entrance. Most every door in the house is missing a door stop. thermostat above the thermostat we do not have a CO detector I 
Refrigerator works well. Gas stove works well. Dishwasher, not so much. It just hums or vibrates. But I did not get any water to the unit earlier today. We're going to ask that that be checked. A master with tray ceilings. Touch up paint throughout. Good job. No challenges. Again, structurally with the hum. Aesthetically and also preventative maintenance. I need to replace that caulk. As you can see, some of these areas, areas you can slip a pencil down. That's pulling away quite a ways on that tile over there. Water on the floor is just going to cause subfloor damage. We did not have two uh, garage door remote control uh, units left on the <coughs> left on the counter. But that completes our quality control inspection here at Miami Court.